I believe there are two types of people, Kevin. I believe there are only two types of people in the whole world. Either you believe you're a body that happens to have a spirit, or you're the type of person who believes you're a spirit primarily that just happens to have a body. Those are the only two type of people on planet Earth. Either you believe the body is primary or the spirit is primary. I would like to have, if I could have one wish in America, is for every American to answer that question. To answer that question truthfully to themselves. And if you're the type of person that believes the body is primary, that, that, the, that the natural world is primary, you will have a very limited perspective on what the possibilities of your life are, what the potential could be, and what you can accomplish through your life. And you also are the type of person that cannot realize that the highest things, the best things, are the things that you can't see. Love, which you can't see, is greater than lust, which you can see played out before your very eyes. Courage is higher than being afraid like a child. The things that are higher are the things that are invisible. And so I would submit for your consideration that the, the true orientation of the person who's going to make a difference, not only in this life, but then after they're gone, it's going to have a lasting impact, is the person that realizes that you and I are primarily spirits that just happen to have bodies. That we will live forever. And if we will live forever, we will conduct ourselves in different ways, right? If I have a habit of looking at certain things online and I'm only going to live 100 years, well, that may only have a certain amount of damage if I live 100 years. But if I, if I do that and I keep that same mentality, I let that grow over a million years. If I'm going to live for a million years, as, as the great C.S. Lewis said, that in the end, I would become a devil. I've become the worst imaginable thing. And so that's why we have to look and take ourselves accountable and, and hold ourselves to the highest possible integrity, the highest type of possible morality. And that's the thing that we can do because America is only a collections, collection of Kevins and Ricks and Bobs and Steves and Marys and, and Janes and a collection of all of us.